You may have noticed that last week we didn't have a vlog, that's because there's no real noticeable changes, but this week it's all starting to change. So let's go through to the staff room, Wade's weekly vlog, episode 60. Because this has now been screeded. Now the guy said it might need another layer of screed before it's completely perfect. The reason why this wasn't done before is because the floor was too damp. So we had to wait for the um, actual concrete to completely dry out before it was ready to be screeded and then the flooring on top. So that's the first coat gone down today. Before we had to do that, you had to scrape all the floor, make sure it's got most of the, um, the old flooring up and then he could lay his screed down. So now let's go upstairs and see what they've been doing up there. Right, the first thing you'll notice, we actually have a light switch. So we can now see what we're doing up here. No longer am I working off a work light when I'm showing you what's going on up here. So we've got a handrail going up to the top of waves. And it's nice and bright, lots of lights and most of it has been painted, but Shane said he can't finish off until he's got better lighting. And now we have better lighting. So when Shane is free again, he'll be back to finish the painting. But you can see there's not much more really to do up here. We're not actually, oh, there's no light in there yet. We're not actually gonna have a carpet or anything up here. It's just the stores. So we're just leaving it down with the plywood. We've got this as well. So a window needs to go in there. I'm sure that'll get sorted soon. It's actually quite cold up here, so the plumber needs to come back and put us a radiator or two on. See the pipe work for it just there. Loft hatch, that's got to go back into the other room. I think that was actually the wrong loft hatch, so they've got to get another one to fit. But as you can see, Thing is coming along nicely. It was completely different to what it did just a couple months ago. So if we go down here, assuming it's all finished mostly finished in here. All looking pretty good. So what you will notice is there's loads of red cable hanging out. That's for the fire alarm. That's in every room. So the electrician's got to come back and sort that at some point. But apart from that, apart from the electrician needs to finish off a few bits and pieces, the plumber, I think, get that loft ladder or loft hatch fixed. That will then be this stage complete. And it's a bit dark. Oh, you can't see because there's no window here. It's a bit dark at the minute. It's late, it's, I don't know, 11 o'clock at night on a Tuesday night. So I won't show you outside, but their main builders have started again. I'll see if I can get a video of them tomorrow. There was digging out. Um, I don't know if they're getting ready to underpin one section of the shop. I think that's what they were doing. We'll ask them tomorrow. So today the builders have been out and they've removed this part of the wall. If you remember, we had this wall built up because this was going to be the extension. But now the whole site is going to be the extension. So if we keep it focused just where you are there, you can see they've actually started the underpinning of that side. And you can see one of our oak beams going across there. That will need finishing off. But if we spin it back round, this is what they've done so far. And all the bricks have actually gone to my house. I've just got to clean them up. And I'm going to use them on a brick wall down the bottom of my garden. It's Saturday and we've had the plumbers here today. As you can see behind us, we now have the radiator upstairs. 
one just there and one just through here. So once I've actually finished the outside of this building, because at the minute, on the outside, it's still open, so it's still quite drafty up here, it will be a lot warmer. We also had the flooring guys finish off last night. So we've now got the flooring down in the downstairs kitchen and toilet area. I thought we'd better have a last look at what they've been doing this week outside. So, you can see it looks a bit clearer along this side. They've started digging down, removing a load of the earth. You can see there's still a lot to get rid of over there. And I believe we're getting a big lorry next week to actually take most of this muck and bricks and whatever's in there away, setting it ready for the foundations. <laughs>